Black Bears picked up a nice win last night over the Pinckney Division leading Muck Dogs. And the difference between Wednesday night's win and Tuesday night's loss, it was timely hitting. West Virginia also got another good start from No Toribio. Only allowed one hit in five innings of work, and he picked up his second straight win on the bump. And Moonshiner skipper Drew Saylor talked about Toribio last night, speaking to what he did well and what he still needs to improve on. You know, especially tonight, he was starting it a little bit, you know, down the middle and the inner third, and guys were getting some swings. And by the time the ball gets to the plate, it's a little bit lower than what they th think it's supposed to be, and uh, had some early swings. Uh, still has some, you know, work to do in terms of the fourth and fifth inning. Uh, felt he got in some, you know, lengthy counts there, got a little bit, for me, gun shy of the strike zone. He just needs to continue to keep the same pace and tempo he had in the first three. Also in this game, Brent Sita definitely went the distance last night. Uh, Sita, who was just joining the team two weeks ago, hit his first home run with the team and went three for three in the win. And we caught up with him after the game last night as well. Yeah, I mean, I've always kind of felt uh, that I was an underdog. And, and I mean, being 30th rounder doesn't really stick with me at all. I mean, I, I, I'm here to compete and, and do what I can to help the team win and, and just keep going. I mean, I, I like to shock people and show them who I am. So. Always good to have an underdog story there. The Moonshiners look to pick up a series win tonight against the Muck Dogs, and we'll have the final score for you back here tonight at 11.